Soviet forces retreated or surrendered in several key areas today. Find out where on War Watch at 9. Don't get too comfortable, Commander. Romanov still has plenty of fight left. Apparently the Soviets thought we wouldn't notice this research facility in the Yucatan. By these readings, we can see that they're trying to replicate Einstein's PRISM technology. Your destination is the ruined Mayan city of Tulum, near the Caribbean coast. We're paradropping a SEAL team to help you locate and destroy the facility. I think you're going to like these guys. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Battle control online. Let's get it on. Cover me. Alright. Hello everyone. This is Lee Time of Five Random Guys back with the next mission of Red Alert 2 Allied Campaign. And it's like four o'clock in the morning, so <laughs> uh luckily I don't have to work tomorrow, so I'm gonna do this. I've been meaning to do it all week, but I've been busy playing Unepic, which is a very fun game. Um so, yes, starting off, uh, this is pretty much a straightforward mission. There's no real, um, there's no, like, building or construction or anything like that. Though there is the option to do so, and, you, and you'll find out a little bit later. I don't do the option, I pretty much go in and, and uh, kill everything. I got him. Now, I got him. This is too easy. This is too easy. How about a swim? Enemy in my sight. Enemy in my sight. Reinforcements have arrived. How about a Incoming transmission. Commander. The SEAL team has liberated a group of local freedom fighters. They were kind enough to give us the location of the Soviet research facility in exchange for the opportunity to fight by our side. I didn't think you'd mind. Can do! I'm a little disappointed in my run with this. Uh, typically, normally this is, I never have really much difficulty with this mission, but... Yeah, this one gave, gave me a hard time for some reason, <laughs> and it will come, become apparent later. Um, I don't know if I was focusing right. I, I recorded this early, earlier today, so this is all in one, uh, one evening. Though at the very end, some one of the funniest things I've ever done in this game. Something that I, sh I, I finished the mission in a way I should never have done. Um, anyways, I'm not fast forwarding this any at all since there's no real uh, building or anything. Even though I have the option, now that I have a, a, a helicopter full of engineers, I can capture their base and build up a force. And it does give, you, give me money to do so. But I don't go with that route, which I probably should have, but I didn't do it. Anyways, um, talking about, I should be talking about this, these new units. These units are the Navy SEALs. They pretty much upgrade like Tanya, with the exception that they do have a reload time. Uh, a slightly longer re reload time than hers. Now, I was getting a little concerned about the helicopter, but I noticed that they were that the enemy units were just passing it up, so I decided, ah, that's, my helicopter's fine right there. I probably won't need it. <sighs> but anyways, the Navy SEAL does operate very similar to... Yeah, I got too close there. Oops. Um... Does, uh, they do operate very similar to Tanya, but 
they're only available in campaign mode. Uh, in this game, at least. They're not available in the, uh, in the scrimmage, uh, in the scrimmage games, so. Good to go. Good to go. So, yeah. Um. High speed, low drag. Hot tamale! That's no Mayan pyramid, that's a prism cannon! Yeah. So, um, as you see, my kind of strategy was to get through here, and I think this is where I started to mess up. Um, I decided I'm gonna go through the... <laughs> I'm just gonna go th right through the side door, <laughs> the side entrance. Yeah, I probably should have uh, went around with such a small group. But yeah, there... But yeah, this, to be honest, this mission seemed like it was kind of thrown in to the game. Um, it's as if they needed, they felt that they needed more missions, so they're like, hey, let's throw this one in. But it did kind of introduce the uh, Navy SEALs and stuff, and they did do become handy. Um... Now, the infantry or the um, reinforcements that they give you, every time you destroy one of those uh, those temples or the their replica of the prism towers, they drop one more navy seal, which I find to be the most useless because it's not fully leveled up like this one, like these. And I'm about to lose anyways. <laughs> As you can see, I'm down to my... One infantry unit and five Navy SEALs. Now just the five Navy SEALs. And they do shift towards the tanks, and I kind of got a little too close there and made me lose another Navy SEAL and damage my units. So, yeah, as you can tell, I'm not doing well here. Um, I did complete the first objective which was destroy those uh unit lost those uh, unit lost. Um, towers but my other objective was to destroy their base yeah if you guys see where this is going it's not going to it's not going to end too well why they sent out two planes to uh drop another Navy SEAL and an engineer, I'll never know. But yeah, so... <laughs> oh, the fun. This does not end well. Yeah, because my Navy SEALs, they are... They're really good for buildings and, and infantry units, just like uh, Tanya, but they're not good towards tanks, so... Now this is take two of the of the mission. <laughs> um, I'm starting in a, after I get the uh, other units because pretty much the first part I did the same. Um, and this second try, I do pretty much the same strategy and everything, except I move my the helicopter to the top right along the beach. They don't mess. With, they didn't mess with it there. Um. But I tried again to get in through through this side entrance, and I burned up one of my Navy SEALs, and pretty much tore up all my other ones. Yeah. Can anyone guess where this one's going? Yeah. Well, it's doing. A, I'm doing a, a, somewhat better than last time until I decided I'm gonna destroy. <laughs> Or this unit, this again. Of course, it didn't. It didn't hurt too much. At least now I was using all my units. But I start I start messing up here because I just I already lost the tank and now and now I'm just I'm kind of playing offense right there in their uh, little space and there goes another one of my tanks. So I'm now. Kinda screwed.
rude. Because those tanks are supposed to help me towards their uh, vehicle units. So, I get the idea. Yeah, I get the idea right about now to, uh, well, maybe. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to destroy everything thing they have and bring back their uh, uh, tanks and stuff to, uh, uh, to my, uh, my deployed uh, units. But then I kind of realized, I should realize, like, right here. That yeah, there it is. I can put my infantry units in there, which kind of helps for a little while until they sent out three tanks. Yeah, so I again there there goes uh, my uh, units and everything. Yeah, so that didn't end well. So I was left with my helicopter. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna use my helicopter to uh, to attack. Nope, they've got their flank cannons at me, and unit lost. Mission yeah. failed. Yeah. All right, third <laughs> third time's the charm, maybe. All right. Now you'll see you'll see real quickly that I've changed up my strategy a little bit. I'm still not capturing anything, uh, even though I can capture. But I decide, yeah, I lost a couple of units there for because of those dogs. But um, I decide to go around the other way, which seemed to work out better. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know why this mission was giving me a hard time. I usually don't have a very hard time, and the next mission is is actually is really the first one to actually start giving trouble, giving me trouble. But yeah, as you can see, I actually came through the side this time instead of through going through um, one of their. I don't know why that seal decided it was gonna uh, follow the harvester. Um, but yeah, I decided to go through the side instead of going through one of the entrances. So yeah, I'm pretty much my tanks and everything. They're pretty much taking care of everything else then. Out, so at least I didn't waste them at, uh, rel relatively quickly. Um, of course, they're pretty much gone now. <laughs> really, I should really I should have captured some of their uh, some of their stuff. At least I could actually. I, at least I could build more units. Now, now they're sending everything they've got. I've destroyed. I pretty much made the mistake of destroying everything that they had. So now it's time to play Ring Around the Rosie. <laughs> I mean, seriously, that's. I have the one unit. Well, I have three units and a engineer. So I'm pretty much. Yeah, I mistakenly destroyed all my units there. But yeah, I'm pretty much... <laughs> I'm sending it, sending them around. They cannot ke keep up with them. So, I get the clever idea. I have a helicopter, and it has a gun. And I also have some... Some engineers in it. So, let me use those engineers to uh, save them. <laughs> So now I'm out of units except for the helicopter and the couple of uh, uh, engineers that are in it. But my problem was every time it destroyed something, it kept wanting to land. So now I have a very damaged helicopter, which is 
which is the only unit that can do damage. So... Yeah... What the hell can I do? I have to destroy all these... all those buildings. The uh, defense uh, turrets and everything, too. Luckily, I don't have to destroy all the... Uh, all their units and stuff. So... I <laughs> start using the helicopter. And yes, I I have to speed this up because this took f forever. This alone took about 10 minutes <laughs> to do. Because the gun on this helicopter is not the best thing in the world. Um, I took one of my engineers trying to figure out what the hell I can do with them. And if I can capture something. <laughs> Nope, can't capture a thing. So I just sent one uh, up north, so... In case, just in case, I lose the helicopter. I won't lose right away. <laughs> I'll be just avoiding the inedible... Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I didn't send him up there. I, I started to. I think I stopped him. Um... But I sent him to the shore instead. Now, as you see, I'm. I noticed this guy running down here, and I was afraid that he was gonna actually go <laughs> attack my engineer. So I went and killed him with the barrels. Which, again, I prob. It wouldn't have mattered since they can't do shit anyways. <laughs> But now it's a fully ranked uh, <laughs> um, helicopter, so it shoots twice as fast, and it heals over time. So I let it heal up a little bit before I went to <laughs> destroy the last one. But, needless to say, I completed this time. <laughs> I have to say, I was laughing the whole time I was playing. <laughs> at that point, I was like, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> that helicopter is not meant for combat. It, the gun is just for, like, uh, defense only. But, yeah. But, it, I did it. 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's it for this episode I hope you guys, guys enjoyed it please like, subscribe, share with your friends <laughs> and don't go with that strategy that I did in this one <laughs> I'll see you guys next time C'est une obligation. Détruire tout. C'est une obligation. Détruire tout. C'est une obligation.